when we're looking at a five-minute conversation, I first begin with what I call research. So I'm beginning by asking myself, what do I know about the student as a reader? What do I know about the student as a writer? What can I do to look at his or her writing or his or her reading life to make sure that I'm really well prepared that for that five-minute precious time that I'm going to have with him? The second phase of that, of that conversation is the, the inside the conversation piece, which is the teach. The teach, try, clarify, which is what we call the stages of a complete four conference. So in other words, within that conversation, I'm really thinking about my teaching point. And what's beautiful about it is it's not happening in isolation. The complete four gives me something to teach. Teachers often ask us, what am I supposed to do with those conferences? I don't know what to say to my students when I sit next to them. But with the Complete Four, we give you the foundation. We give you a framework so that when you sit beside that student, you're not just talking within the moment. You're never talking in an isolated moment. You're talking about the big picture. What are we studying together now? Let's talk about our work together inside the unit of study. Let's talk about our work within the conversation we've all been having about grammar or the conversation we've all been having about building a reading identity. And so our conferences become clearer, sharper, and more meaningful for our students.